Hello and today I'll introduce to you something uh, very interesting to many uh, hobbyist engineers and radio engineers as well. So I've seen on YouTube many people trying to construct an RF sniffer or RF uh, signal strength indicator, simple circuit and this is very very simple circuit. It's basically made of uh, an inductor I picked uh, from my component uh, stack. Um, at, at random actually i could uh, make my own calculations which i i have in my computer and uh, uh, choose the right inductor and capacitor in parallel for the right frequency okay but i picked this at random i know i, I can i can do much better design this is just on the fly uh, circuit i constructed it's basically made of uh, let me show you it's made of uh this uh, darlington transistor maybe you don't see that properly okay this is the darlington transistor this one is darlington transistor high gain uh, transistor inductor this is the inductor and this is the antenna here this wire is the antenna okay it's about 12 centimeters long of course two double uh, a batteries an LED indicator and a sound element, sounding element, and of course a current limiter resistor here. I have a current limiter resistor and I have germanium diode. Actually, I don't have schematic because I created this schematic from my mind. I really don't need schematic for those kind of designs because this is to me is uh, like common sense. Uh, so uh, if you are engineer, radio engineer, you, you know uh, exactly what I'm talking about. So I've seen people actually using uh, an, a dedicated IC ship to uh, do something similar to this, uh, like RF sniffer. You really don't need that. Okay, so let me demonstrate it to you. This is uh, a wireless uh, family radio. Okay, so it's turned on right now. It's made by Radio Shack. Okay, so... Uh, if I if I press the talk to button, okay, and I approximate it, you see here the okay. Let me turn off the light, okay. So if I approximate this radio from this antenna of this uh, RF sniffer, look what happened, okay. And you you see the LED light here. See how when I approximate this antenna of the family radio to the antenna, see what happened to the LED. Of course, you see the buzzer as well. You hear the sound of the sounding alarm. Okay, so as you can see, okay, so it acts as a really very good uh, radio frequency or RF sniffer. Uh, of course, I connected that to a spectrum analyzer. This is professional, uh, high quality, high end uh, spectrum analyzer. Uh, I connected it to the computer via USB. So now I can, I turned my computer laptop monitor into spectrum analyzer so if you see if i press the talk to button see what happened okay so you you have this uh, peak it's uh, it's centered around 462 megahertz and the amplitude about minus 27 dbm okay so minus 27 dbm uh, and uh, that's what happened actually I ran out of uh, power yeah I ran out of power maybe if I do that okay I am back into power so if I so uh, you, you you got the idea actually I'm running out of battery in my radio because I did a lot of testing so uh, basically the, the spectrum analyzer is is an excellent because it can pick the uh, any radio source from far away and you can see that reflecting so what i did here what i did is when this radio transmitter or uh, family radio transmitting it produced this peak here this peak is once it exceeds this line it sounds uh, a sound as you heard from the uh, windows environment okay so so this this spectrum analyzer acts as a wonderful actually i tested it it tests uh, it can detect the radio from uh, uh, like more than 20 meters away okay so like if you go if you take this radio and go wander around this spectrum analyzer can stick 
can still pick the uh, uh, the signal from this radio and display it on the uh, on the computer on the spectrum analyzer so so bottom line guys you can really construct your own rf sniffer from only darlington transistor germanium diode and inductor and of course there is a parasitic capacitor here i didn't indicate that but the parasitic in, uh, capacitor in parallel with the inductor they make as you know like at the resonance frequency they make high impedance so this high impedance is being amplified by the darlington transistor uh, of course, there is some rectification here because of the germanium diode. So this this uh, uh, RF signal is then passed uh, to the LED, uh, and the LED is is being fed current from uh, the uh, transistor uh, uh, emitter to uh, from transistor emitter to collector. Okay, I'm sorry, I mentioned the uh, uh, gate. It was not gate actually. It was base of Darlington transistor. Uh, I I'm, I have been using a lot of uh, MOSFETs <laughs> transistors those days. So so this one here is Darlington transistor. Uh, uh, the base of the transistor is connected to the inductor, of course, with with the parasitic uh, parallel capacitor, and then the so the not the source the the emitter connected to the ground, and the collector is connected is uh, connected to the LED, and LED connects to the positive rail of the three volts from AA battery. So basically you have a buzzer and LED that work together. Let me try it, okay. So as you have see, if I approximate my radio, I'm gonna press the button. I'll keep it pressed to see what happened. It's very sensitive, it's very, it's amazing. It's a very simple circuit. So, so you really need, you don't need complex circuit. It's a very simple circuit, okay. Uh, and uh, that's it. Of course, for this guy here, you have to pay very big money. So, so like people who cannot afford it, uh, this one can cost you like uh, if you have a, a, an old radio or if you go to Radio Shack or to the source in Canada here or uh, to any electronic shop from DigiKey, you can buy this uh, uh, Darlington transistor for about uh, 10, 20 cents. Okay, so it's very cheap. Uh, and then in in uh, with less than at one dollar canadian you can build this rf sniffer with this uh, with three volts battery of course okay and a little piece of wire uh, acting as an antenna so, so so this is not perfectly designed like i just picked uh, uh, components uh, at random from my uh, component stock and uh, i built this circuit i hope you enjoy this uh, uh, fast presentation of how to build your own RF sniffer.